I grew up in a large family. My mother was widowed when she was 47. There were difficult times. I know the difficulties people are going through now. I've worked with Gay Mitchell for over 30 years and I know he has always been a successful innovator in every job that he has done and he always puts Ireland first. Ireland is at an important crossroads. We can't go back to where we were. Let's build a new, better country. Gay Mitchell is determined to stop our young people from having to leave the country. As your president, I will do everything in my power and I will work tirelessly to bring investment and jobs to our country. Gay Mitchell speaks for those with no voice and gives them that voice. For too long, we've put financial wealth before mental health. As your president, I would like to help lead us in a different direction. I know all about Gay Mitchell's compassion and drive. I'm married to him for 31 years. Ireland has the lowest infant mortality rate in the world. That wasn't always the case. Right now, 22,000 children die every day in the developing world. We can lead the world in changing that. The 1916 proclamation speaks of prosperity and happiness. By the centenary of the proclamation, as president, I would like to lead this country to prosperity and happiness. In difficult times, we need a president who understands our past and who believes in our future. We need Gay Mitchell. On October the 27th, we ask you to lend us your support and to give Ireland the president it deserves. <laughs>